Hey, this is Austin from Safe Haven Music, and today we're checking out the IC420 from Ibanez. <laughs> Two we have available here are the Flame Maple Violin Sunburst as well as the Antique Blue Metallic. Um, the one we don't have is, I don't remember the actual color name. Oh, wait. Damn. Damn, you remember what Devin. it's called? <laughs> what is that red called? Uh, red burst? Red, just red burst? Uh, no, I'm not, I'll find out actually. Yeah. Like a superhero name. And the one we don't have is Antique Autumn Burst. Both of these guitars have a three-piece Akume neck as well as an Akume body, which is like a mahogany alternative, as well as a Jatoba fretboard, which is similar to Rosewood, except it is a little more red. This Iceman is gonna have binding on the body and the neck and all the way up around the headstock. 22 medium frets. The inlays are acrylic and has a little bit of abalone on the 12th fret. Gold hardware, Gibraltar bridge, and these Ibanez grip knobs. <laughs> But the really cool thing about these guitars is that they come with the original Super 80 pickups uh, that came in the original 1978 Iceman. Got the little flying finger logo on them, as well as a ceramic magnet. They're a really well-balanced humbucker. Um, I think they sound really good clean as well as distorted. Uh, you get some really crazy tones out of these. With these pickups, you got a three-way selector switch as well as a volume and tone for each one. Uh, pretty straightforward setup. And these are going to come with a padded gig bag. Now these do look like a pretty big and thick guitar, but the Akume body and neck is really lightweight. These are all sitting between 7 and 8 pounds, which is really nice. This has been the first time in a long time where Ibanez has actually released the Iceman as a regular production line, so that's really cool. Now everyone's seen Paul Stanley and Darren from System of a Down play these Icemans, but the Sunburst one really reminds me of Pig Champion from Poison Idea, except he chopped this little bit off. Uh, but more recently, it's been being used by Isaac from Knocked Loose, as well as AJ from Creeping Death. <laughs> Today we were running the Iceman through our Quad Cortex. The distortion channel that you heard was a Marshall Jubilee patch, and the clean one was an AC30 patch. Both of them were boosted by this swollen pickle that we have here. This has been Austin from Safe Haven Music. Uh, if you want to check out these Iceman or any of our other guitars for sale, check out our social media online.